friends, welcome back to another video. Um, just wanted to, first of all, talk about how crazy this weather is. It's w welcome, we really need the snow. And down here in the valley, we didn't get a whole lot. We just kind of got it dusting with some rain, but it's been incredibly cold. And, but, you know, at least the mountains have been getting a good amount of snow and it's not even Thanksgiving yet. So that's a really good blessing. And uh, just grateful for that. For this video, it's basically gonna be me thanking you guys. I have people that watch these videos that have been watching since the very beginning. And I had recently have gained quite a bit of new viewers and new subscribers. And I am so incredibly grateful to all of you. This video is the marks the two year anniversary of this channel, of me trying to make these videos, of me trying to, even though I'm not an expert, it's not something I, that I went to school to learn. I did want to do something where I shared with you my struggles, my attempts to be physically and mentally healthy. Because for years, I have struggled with this. And my biggest problem had always been my head, my depression, not believing that I'm good enough when I am. And I always tried to fight through this on my own. I had so much trouble with being able to share the pain that I go through, the, the, the emotional scarring that I have, the trauma. <clears throat> and it wasn't until only a few months ago that I started going to therapy. And that's the number one thing that I think that has been doing so much good for me lately is my decision to go to therapy. And I've mentioned this all before in other videos, and I'm sorry if I sound like a broken record, but I think this is so important because a lot of us a lot have experienced these kind of tra these kind of traumas, and we struggle and try to do it all on our own when we don't. There's people that want to help us and who understand what you're going through because a lot of these ther therapists have gone through it themselves. So there is no shame in going to therapy. And that has been a game changer for me. And that's why I really push it because for years, I always tried to be do it alone. For years, I would turn to eating junk in order to bury that pain. Um, you know, some people use alcohol, others use drugs. Food was my drug. And it provided me that momentary pleasure that made me feel good about my, feel good. But it did so much damage. Well, obviously you can see because I'm a rather big guy. And, but, I, I am making so much progress. It's, it's been slow. It's been a very long, windy road, but I haven't given up on myself. And I fight through and take every offer of help that I can. And that's what I'm hoping to be able to give to you with this channel. I said that since the very first video and to how many, whatever number this video is <clears throat> for the two year anniversary. I just want to provide what I share with you, what I've learned. And, you know, you, you guys still watch, even though I stumble over my words, I stutter hard, or sometimes I just get, blank or, or, or get a like a blank look or something like that and usually when that happens that's because i know the word that i want to get out 
but it's like it's stuck in my throat and it's not the normal stuttering, uh, uh, whatever. But you guys stuck through it anyhow. So I think that's been the number one big thing that's been helpful for me is to work with the therapist to overcome my depression. And you know, it's not gonna go away. These, the pain is, you're gonna have anxiety attacks. It's never gonna really go away. It's just giving you the skills and tools to be able to work through those moments where when you're having thoughts of killing yourself. I had a lot of those. So, and just realizing that despite all the negativity in this world, there's a lot of it. We are constantly bombarded by the media, by, you know, getting pissed off at or government, whatever. All right, I got sidetracked, sorry. <laughs> but that has been such a huge help for me. The number two uh, thing that I think has been helpful in my progress in my mental and my physical health is having a good friends that you could t trust because sometimes even if you don't can't go see a, a therapist, if you have people that you can trust, your best friend, you, a brother or sister that you're so close with that they, you trust them with everything or anything, talk to them. They, if, be there for them, but they are, remember that they are there for you. Because I was always, making myself available and help to be able to help everyone people family whatever but i rarely asked help for myself and but i've been very lucky i have two people in my life right now that i trust completely that i love very much and they are my best friends. And I couldn't ask for bed people to have in my life. So, so have a good support system. And number three, that has been a huge help for me is upping my intake of water. I always thought that I drank enough, but I didn't. I was, my body was dehydrated constantly until I started reading up on it. And I've been drinking a gallon of water every day, sometimes more, because sometimes I just, my body needs more. But water is really good, definitely for keeping you hydrated and all that but it cleans out your body. It cleans out your blood, your system, and gets up those toxins out of your body. And, you know, another thing that's been a huge deal is I've been trying to eat more fermented foods, pickled foods, um, stuff like that. Um, I make my own sourdough bread. I have started from the beginning where I, am, I usually bake a couple of loaves every single week, and it's really good for your gut health. It's got the good bacteria that you need for breaking down food and cleaning out your intestines to so that it doesn't just clog up and block you up, stuff you up. All right, that's been a huge help because it is raises it helps raise your metabolism and it helps prevent you from getting, it helps prevents you from getting sick. It adds, yeah, it, it helps to boost your immunity is basically what I'm trying to say, stumbling through my words. And uh, another thing that is really helpful that I've talked about in other videos is trying to walk every single day, but you know, 
not every single day, okay? You need to remember that you need rest. So I usually walk Monday through Friday and I take the weekends off to let my, because I've got two destroyed ankles, bad knees, bad hip, and uh, it's very painful to come out to walk, but you need that time to rest, to heal and recover. So that's what I do Monday through Friday and choose a place that you love to walk at. It's very difficult to choose a place where it's, you don't enjoy it. And if you don't enjoy it, you're not having fun during your walk, then you're gonna end up quitting on yourself. So choose a place that really speaks out to you, that is beautiful. I choose this park every single, from my most of my daily walks. And if I get bored with it, then I change it up and I go to the walking path that goes through the desert. But it, even that's really beautiful spots, beautiful views of the mountains. <laughs> you can't see them and I'm putting them off camera, I'm sorry. So choose a beautiful spot for your walks. If, so, and just remember, you don't have to, you know, set a fast pace for your walks. Walk at what you are capable of doing. That leaves you with where you're getting the workout, but you're not pushing yourself to the past your limits. Because if you push yourself too far, that leads to injuries. And remember that you could stop, and if, if, if it's the springtime for you, and there's beautiful flowers, remember, you could stop and enjoy those flowers. And at the beginning of this video, I mentioned gratitude, how much gratitude that I have towards you guys for watching these videos and subscribing to my channel. But gratitude is such an important thing in our lives. We like get lost in the negativity. And when you get lost to the, in the negativity, it, if, it really, well, it, it, I can, don't have to tell you, you know that it really screws with your head. And when you're in that darkness all the time, there's no, you see no point in trying to take care of yourself, trying to improve your health, your mental health, your physical health, trying to improve your intelligence. Learning, learning is such an important thing, even at no matter what point in your life you are in. And just ha when you try go and focus on that gratitude, it just reminds you how much good and beauty are, is in this world. That it reminds you that you're not some lazy scumbag sitting on your ass doing nothing all the time. It reminds you that, hey, you're an amazing person. You're smart, you're beautiful, and you're amazing. And I hope, you know, you are capable of doing anything. You just have to get over your own mental barriers and push through it. You'll, it'll take time and consist, consistency to push through your physical barriers. You know, it's gonna take time for that weight to drop off. And you just have to be patient for that. But I have faith in you and I hope you have faith in yourself. All right. 
I hope that wasn't too confusing, too crazy, jumbled up words. I try my best. <laughs> but remember, you are loved. I am grateful for you. And I hope you know how amazing you are. Well, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and making this a special two years for this channel. Please help me out to continue to grow. Uh, recently, I, my channel has my views on my videos and my subscribers have been climbing pretty quick. And that is amazing and I'm grateful. And so, but help me to continue to grow by hitting that like button because you don't know how, just how much that like button helps to get my videos out to you guys to be able to watch. And if you have anything to contribute to this video, any comments of that could be helpful for all of us, please leave them down below in the comment section. If you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button and share with your friends. You know, it, I ho hope to be able to help as many people as I can. But, you know, to, to share with your friends and family. And another way you can help support this channel is by visiting my website at www.jbaileyphoto.net. If you haven't figured out yet, I am a photographer. That is my business. And I am working very hard on trying to make that a successful business to be able to support myself, be able to make my dreams come true. And so visit my print store. And if you're looking to redecorate or Christmas is coming up, it's uh, still beginning of November, but it's going to be so much easier if you order soon. And I can get your orders out in, to you as fast as I can. So, but every sale helps to support my channel. All right. That's it. Thank you so much for watching. And take care of yourself. Bye-bye.